found dead in their Nashville home. Their Range Rover slammed into a wall. They were pronounced dead at the scene. Human trafficking, and that's when he was killed in a car crash. American Idol has been the launching pad for some of the biggest names in music. But the road to success isn't always easy. Today, we'll take a look back at some of those talented contestants who graced the Idol stage and tragically passed away, leaving us with their memories of their incredible performances and the promise of what could have been. Join us as we remember these stars and celebrate their legacies. Hey guys, it's Billy and today I want to take the time to celebrate and remember some of our lost American Idol contestants. American Idol changed the scene with a groundbreaking singing competition that discovered young hopefuls across the U.S. and brought us stars like Kelly Clarkson, Jennifer Hudson, Carrie Underwood, Jordan Sparks, Adam Lambert, Chris Daughtry, and more. From music awards, Grammys, to having their own daytime TV shows, Idol has proven to be a star-making machine. With all the glitz and glamour, there's also a dark and tragic side that many people aren't aware of. Several hopefuls have finished the show and met tragic endings, leaving us with the question of what could have been. So let's talk about them, and let's honor them now. Willie Spence. Shine bright like a diamond. Willie Spence was a talented singer who captured the heart of American Idol viewers during his appearances on the show's 19th season in 2021. Hailing from Georgia, Willie had a powerful voice and undeniable charisma that made him an early fan favorite. He wowed the judges and audiences alike with his performances of songs such as Diamonds by Rihanna and Stand Up by Cynthia Erivo. Despite not winning the competition, Willie had secured a loyal following of fans who were eager to see what he would do next. However, on September 7, 2021, news broke that Willie had died after hitting a rear of a tractor trailer that was stopped on the shoulder of Interstate 24 East near Chattanooga. Spence's father says his son was actually on his way for an interview with a company that helps victims of human trafficking, and that's when he was killed in a car crash. He passed away at the young age of 25. His death was a shock to the American Idol community, to us here at Talent Recap. While his time on the show may have been brief, Willie's talent and spirit left a lasting impression on those who knew him, and he will always be remembered as a shining star whose light was extinguished far too soon. In five years, what do you want it to look like? I just want my voice to reach the world and just share my gift. Leah LaBelle. If I don't have you. Leah LaBelle was a talented singer who appeared on American Idol's third season in 2004, but didn't make it past the preliminary round. However, that didn't deter her from pursuing her dreams. She then got discovered by Pharrell and went on to sign a deal with Epic Records. She released a number of successful singles, including Lolita and Sexify. Her music was a blend of pop and R&B, and she was praised for her powerhouse vocals and undeniable star power. Unfortunately, Leah's life was tragically cut short when she was killed in a car accident January 2018 at the age of 31. Crash that killed former Pacers player Razul Butler and his wife Leah LaBelle lost control of their Range Rover slammed into a wall before flipping in a parking lot in Studio City, California. They were pronounced dead at the scene. The cause of the accident was later determined to be Butler speeding and driving under the influence. Leah's death was a shock to her family and friends and she's remembered as a talented artist who left behind a rich musical legacy. Michael Johns. Michael Johns was a talented singer who appeared on American Idol's seventh season in 2008. Mama. Originally from Australia, Michael wowed the judges and the audiences with his soulful voice and impressive range. He quickly became a fan favorite and was known for his charming personality and easygoing demeanor. He was eliminated in the eighth week of the competition, but remained a beloved figure in the American Idol community. Tragically, Michael passed away in August 2014 at age 35 from a leg injury that triggered a blood clot. New details from the Orange County coroner said the clot was related to an alcohol dependency, which had given Michael an enlarged heart and a fatty liver. Regardless, it was a tragic shock to his family and he will be missed. Nikki McGibbon. Nikki McGibbon was an awesome singer with a huge voice who appeared on American Idol's first season in 2002. She was known for her raspy voice and rock and roll style and quickly became a fan favorite with her performance of Black Velvet and a Janis Joplin cover. Although she didn't win the competition, Nikki's appearances on the show helped launch her music career. 
She released a number of singles, an album, and continued to perform and tour throughout the years. Tragically, Nikki passed away in November 2020 at the age of 42. Her death was attributed to a brain aneurysm, which she had suffered earlier in the month. Nikki had fought some demons during her life and had substance abuse issues and appeared in 2008 on Dr. Drew's Celebrity Rehab. She then moved into a sober living house and her time there was chronicled on Sober House, a spinoff of Celebrity Rehab. Nikki also appeared on Fear Factor and Battle of the Network Reality Stars. Nikki was married to Craig Sadler since 2007. She was surrounded by family when she passed at 42 years old. The news of Nikki's death was a shock to the American Idol community and many of her fellow contestants and fans paid tribute to her on social media. She will always be remembered as a talented artist who left an indelible mark on the music world. CJ Harris. CJ Harris was a beloved contestant on the 13th season of American Idol. His soulful voice and charming personality won the hearts of judges and viewers alike, earning him a spot in the top six of the competition. Despite facing personal struggles throughout the show, including the loss of his home in a tornado, CJ persevered and continued to deliver powerful performances week after week. Sadly, CJ suffered a severe heart attack at the age of 31. His heartbreaking death came as a shock to the community. Though CJ's time on earth was cut short, he will always remain in our hearts. I'm in love, you're in love tonight. Haley Smith. Tell me something good. Haley Smith was a talented singer who appeared on American Idol's 11th season in 2012. Her unique voice and folk inspired style made her stand out from the crowd, and she quickly became a fan favorite. Steven Tyler even said, Wow, I love your voice so much. Thank you. You're right out of my era. She was eliminated in the Hollywood round of the competition, but continued to pursue her music career after the show. Tragically, Haley passed away August 2019 at the age of 26. She was involved in a motorcycle accident in Maine and died at the scene from her injuries. Haley's time on American Idol was brief, but her talent and passion for music left a lasting impression on those who knew her. She will always be remembered as a gifted artist taken from us far too soon. Kyle Jacobs. Bill Kelly Pickler woke up and she couldn't find her husband or unlock a door to a room she thought he was in. Kyle Jacobs was a gifted singer who appeared on American Idol's ninth season in 2010. He was also the husband to American Idol star Kelly Pickler. His soulful voice and heartfelt performances made him a standout contestant and he quickly gained a loyal following. Although he didn't make it to the finals of the competition, Kyle's appearances on the show helped launch his music career. He went on to write hit songs for a number of country music stars, including Garth Brooks and Tim McGraw. The cause of his death has not been disclosed by his family, but it was later revealed that Kelly Pickler had suffered an unimaginable loss. I'm just so thankful to have her in my life. I really, truly am. The Nashville Police Department said the country singer's husband was found dead after an apparent suicide at Kelly's Tennessee home. Kyle was a great singer and an amazing writer that will not be forgotten. Ricky Smith. Ricky Smith appeared on American Idol's second season in 2003. His powerful voice and energetic performances made him a fan favorite and he quickly became one of the most memorable contestants of that season. Although he didn't win the competition, Ricky's appearances on the show helped launch his music career. He released an album and several singles and continued to perform on tour throughout the years. Tragically, Smith was involved in a multi-car wrong-way collision on I-240 just outside Oklahoma City. The Dell City native Ricky Smith died this morning. You might know him from American Idol. Where he According to Oklahoma Highway Patrol Captain Paul Timmons, 27-year-old Gerardo Cerda Jr. was traveling in a pickup truck headed westbound in the eastbound lanes and slammed head-on into Smith's vehicle. Smith died on the scene of multiple blunt force injuries, according to the Oklahoma Office of the Chief Medical Examiner. Ricky passed away in May 2016 at the age of 36 and will always be remembered by his family and the music community as a super talent. Joanne Borgella. Joanne Borgella was a talented singer and a model who appeared on American Idol's seventh season in 2008. 
Her soulful voice and stunning beauty made her stand out from the crowd. She quickly became a fan favorite. She made it to the top 24 of the competition, but was unfortunately eliminated in the first week of the finals. However, her appearances on the show helped launch her career in the entertainment industry, and she went on to model for several major brands and released her own music. Tragically, Joanne passed away in October 2014 at the age of 32. She'd been battling a rare form of cancer known as endometrial cancer, and her condition had deteriorated rapidly in the weeks leading up to her death. Her passing was a shock to her family and friends, and many tributes were paid to her on social media. Joanne is gone, but not forgotten. It is always difficult to say goodbye to talented individuals who've left us too soon. The contestants we've talked about today were all gifted singers who left a lasting impression on American Idol fans and the world of music in general. While we may never know what could have been, we can honor their legacies by continuing to celebrate their music and the impact they've left behind. Willie, Michael, Leah, Nikki, Haley, Kyle, Ricky, Joanne, CJ, Rest in peace and thank you for sharing your gifts with us.